Now, when I grew up, when I was a kid, I lived in Mexico. And uh, from when I was, I know, I know, I know, like I'm aware that that's like not <laughs> Pennsylvania cool. crushes Mexico. Yes. You guys are dying to get to PA, dude. Yes. <laughs> and I got obsessed with the idea of the president of the United States. It's where it became a thing to me. And the president at the time was Nixon. I cut a picture out of him, uh, of him out of the paper. And I put it, taped it up next to Nixon? my bed. Yes, I loved Richard Damn, Nixon. When loved I was a Nixon. little kid, I was so about Richard Nixon. And I wrote a letter to my abuelita, my grandma. Yeah. And I sent her a picture of Nixon and said, this is the president of the United States. He's the greatest He's the man, man. Greatest man in the country. He's so cool. He's the best man. I didn't know a single thing about <laughs> yeah, him. Yeah. And he had this serious face. And I had a dream. It's the first dream I remember. I the My bedroom was in the front of our house. So you looked out at the front of our house. And it, I was uh, asleep. And it was m like a Sunday morning. And I heard a band, like a marching band. And I looked outside. And it was Nixon. <laughs> Like walking up my street, just no, no spectators. Yeah. Just him walking up my, with, followed by a marching man. Boom, boom, ba -dum, ba -dum. And I came out on the front yard. I, we had this walkway and he got down on one knee and he said, Louie. <laughs> <laughs> and I ran into his arms. <laughs> and what the fuck? <laughs> Damn, you love Nick. <laughs> I loved him so much. <laughs> Damn, Isn't dude. that crazy? <laughs> I've never you, told anybody that. How you know that? Are I've you? never told anybody that in my life. And so, <laughs> Louis, <laughs> oh, Louis. <laughs> oh, like, senor. <laughs> oh, and it's funny. There's the only Presidente, senor. <laughs> the idea of his joy, because Nixon was such a miserable man <laughs> that his joyful side was very rare. There's only one time I've ever seen it on film. And it's when he's playing piano. He's in a tuxedo. And I think he's at his daughter's wedding. And he was a concert pianist. He was very good. And he's playing piano and he plays some big crescendo. And he's got this big dumb <laughs> grin on his face. And I think maybe I had seen that because that's the only that grin. Every time I see it, I'm in that dream. So but my parents saw that I had these pictures of him next to my bed. And they were like, he's not. A good he's not that great. <laughs> he's not because Wargate was happening. Yeah. And every night my parents were sitting in front of the TV, this little fucking color TV, watching Watergate, watching the hearings. And it was like shh. And, and you're like, how's serious. it going? Yeah, I'm like, like how's, how's my, my, how's my how's boy he, going? How's he doing? Yeah. <laughs> and Nixon's resignation was just like a depressing, uh, destroying, sad, fucked up thing. It was just like, what now? You so fucking precious when you smile. <laughs> yeah. Hit it from the back and drive you wild. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Girl, I lose myself up in those eyes. <laughs> I just had to let you know you're. Oh, yeah.